Hello, it's 9 p.m. in RTD. It's time to English news. For tonight's headlines, uh, we have uh, the president of the Republic is involved in the ribbon cutting ceremony for the new African Sun trip. For the international scene, 600,000 deaths toll in the worldwide concerning coronavirus. Welcome to our newsroom. The President of the Republic, Ismail Omar Gele, inaugurated this morning the first container ship of Djibouti Shipping Company, DSC. The national shipping company created two and a half year early in 2017, owned by the state. The Djibouti Shipping Company's main mission is to provide our country with services in the area of uh, maritime transport goods. Uh, this is an essential initiative for countries that, like the Republic of Djibouti, dedicate a major part of uh, their economic uh, development to port and maritime activities. Uh, Once the red ribbon was cut, the director of maritime affairs, uh, Ali Miraha Shehem, uh, handed the certificate uh, to the National Shipping Company, the acting director of the National Shipping Company, Mr. Adam Duxi, who is in turn handed the certificate of authorizations of the representatives of private companies, namely Wasisa Impact Solution, Al Gamiretsi Global, and Al Johara Al Hurma. The president of authority and port of prison, Obakara Omar Hadi, said uh, expressing his joy, he also expressed stressed that this container ship was the first in a series of uh, other ships that uh, will enable Djibouti Shipping Company to play a leading role in the region as required by market demand. The president of the Republic, His Excellency Ismail Omar Gele, said a few words expressing his joy. He also stressed that this uh, container will uh, that this uh, containers uh, will enable Djibouti shipping companies to play a leading role, and was the first in a series of other ships that will enable Djibouti shipping company to play a leading role in the region. And as required by market demand, he said the vocations of Djibouti shipping company. This new national shipping company will draw profile from the transport and transshipment activity that are increasingly in demand on the sub-regional and regional market and thus contribute to the growth of the activities of Djibouti's container terminals. For his part, the Minister of Transport, Musa Mohammed Ahmed, said expressing his choice. He also stressed that these container ships was the first uh, in a series of uh, other ships that will enable Djibouti shipping uh, company to play a leading role in the region as required by market. The headquarters of the Directorate of International Relations today hosted an important award ceremony for military cooperation 
worker from friendly countries in the framework of military cooperation. Among the recipients were Major General Eric Germes, commanders of the French forces stationed in Djibouti, FFDG, French uh, senior officers and non-commissioned officers, uh, Moroccan technical military assistant uh, stationed at the Military Academy of Officers uh, in Arta. All of them have reached uh, the end of their stay in Djibouti and will have to return to their respective Among the beneficiaries of this distinction is a great civilian personality known in the IDF war, Mr. Abdurrahman Mohammed Haider, owners of the Shihab company, should be highlighted. Mr. Abdurrahman Mohammed Haider is the main supplier of military uniforms and accessories of military ADF since in 1982. The ceremony was presided over General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim. Our chief of staff of the Army Forces on the Djiboutian side participated the chief of the staff uh, Brigadier General Tahir Ali Mohammed, Major General Hassan Ali Kamil, advisor of the CMG, Gen Colonel uh, Ibrahim Zakaria Sheikh, Director of International Relations, and some senior of ADF officials. Uh, the guest was reduced uh, to the strict minimum to fight the COVID-19 pandemic upon his arrival. General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim, accompanied by his Chief of Defense Staff, carried out a review of troops. Then CMG greeted the Djiboutian delegation this uh, review ended with the recipient wearing their ceremonial dress. The other decoration took place in place of the report of International Relations Directorate, the FFDG, Moroccan military assistants all dressed in their ceremonial dress gathered uh, online to receive their decorations. This highlighted the survey the distinction is consisted of Greek Stars Medal awarded to Colonel Antoine Emmanuel, Chief of the Joint Staff, CIMIA, and Chief Medical Officer Blanco de la Torre Pierre, the director of the French Health Services. Uh, other medals included the officers of medals of 27 June, the Knights of Medals of 27 June, and the Grand Star Officers Medal. These various fully deserved distinctions symbolize the efforts made and the services rendered to the nation, each in his and her own file. It is within this framework and satisfied with the accomplished duty that General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim particularly wanted to address his congratulations to them through this uh, decoration. In his speech, the Chief of Staff of the General Army Forces, General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim, first of all addressed his warm congratulations to all the recipients for these distinctions, which they all deserved in spite of a particular context where we are obliged to always respect the barrier miseries of fight against COVID-19. The CMG thanked all the recipients for the effort made during their stay in Djibouti. Let us now listen to the speech from the Chief of Staff, General Army Forces. The health crisis linked to COVID-19 and the entry in containment in the countries have particularly affected the Republic of Djibouti and all economic actors. This situation has also associated to the precariousness of the poorest and more, most vulnerable populations in the country. Faced with the situation, the local authorities, which are members of the associations of local authorities of Djibouti, have obtained funding from the European Union to relieve already vulnerable households whose precariousness uh, has increased in the COVID-19 pandemic for the region of Tikhil, 18 households in the locality of Shekhaidi and 10, uh, 10 kilometers of uh, and 90, 97 households in Kontali at uh, 
12 kilometers from the chief town of the Dekhel region benefit from this food, food uh, donation is, uh, on Thursday. In addition, the EU financed the manufacture of masks and local levels by the companies Ilico, which was al also distributed to, to the beneficiary's household. This ceremony to hand over food, kit, and to the population was held on Thursday, July 16th, uh, in each of these localities in the presence of the President of the Regional Council, Abdurrahman Yunus Ari, and his office is the second Deputy Prefect, uh, Mr. Fuad Abakar Mohammed, and the delegations of the A in led by Mr. Florent Kaku, technical assistant. In uh, Ali Sabih region, the rural localities of uh, Dure, Daspio, and Faradil received yesterday's uh, and the donations of goat of improved breed. Th these are packs of improved breeds, uh, Alpin and Samin, uh, imported from Kenya, one bag per family, one bag per family, which uh, previously, which previously handed over ceremony was attended by the prefect of the region, Musa Adam Migane, the vice president of the regional council, Nuh Said Geldon, the deputy pro project coordinator for DASBIO, Ismail Elmi Habane, and the customer chief of these areas. In uh, the Tijura Regional Council, uh, collaborate uh, with the national associations of local authorities of uh, Djibouti, proceeded to the distribution of food uh, for 127, 125 vulnerable families for the poorest families of the population of Tujara in the presence of the Prefect Hassan Dabeli and the President of the Regional Council, Omar Hussein, the Prefect Hassan Dabeli thanked the European Union uh, very much for this uh, initiative, which will spare no effort to improve the conditions essential for development as evidenced by the fact that they will uh, now have reinforced structures. We have now the wanted uh, notice, uh, Sharmaki Abdullahi's, the Sharmaki Abdullahi's family is looking for that three-year-old son, Ramadan Sharmaki Abdullahi, who lives in his home city in the Willow neighborhood. Uh, this morning at 10 a.m., uh, the little boy was wearing a blue t-shirt and green trousers. Everyone will recognize these descriptions uh, and please contact the families uh, at this uh, number, 7760-7300 and 7788-3951. Please uh, take this child uh, to the nearest uh, police station. Uh. For the international scene, the uh, coronavirus pandemic has killed more than 600,000 people worldwide since its discovery in December 2019, including more than 200,000 in Europe, uh, 160 in Latin America, and the United States is the country with the highest total number of uh, deaths. Uh, 140,000 deaths, uh, followed by Brazil, 78,772. The United Kingdom is 45,273. Mexico, 38,388. 30, uh, and Italy, uh, 35,042. This is it uh, for the news. Thanks for watching us. Uh.